Zikizo muliro, soro kwa nti nuko burani sa, angana we yokuwe linda, we bato kambu chifuicho. Pose chila la, taka lo bati gezanti, tuina bantu basat, ona kuraliro, abagendo kwa nti nuko simbiwa mumbuga zama teka, kuvigambi bokuwa, tiba siga, oba ba kuzi soro limi orusi go chai, muma wanga. Anga kuota deo kwa nti nubwa koze sabubi Miti mba gano Kwa nubwa nubwa waliwa muami Gwa itatai wa Julia Saini miaka kumina muena Ngono Mtuze mchirunji sero Mubende disfikti Nubwa vila uwa muami Gwa itasengo zi David Aba singa Oba kumikutu migata wa nti Uja koze sana dao kwa tiktoka Koze seri nyara kichoisi Saini miaka habili mbumu Ila ngono Mtuze wano nansa na Mwakiso Wali wamlala seka jili aisha ya ono na yeye muna businessi wa gimbo wana muakiso chiga ambibwa bano mubishundwe biyenja ulonga ba kuhesa masi muga we uba computer biyenyi gida mkuisa uba ka uba sigo wachai na kutadino uba tino ba kuhesa bigambo ebi uwe mola uba ebi vola abantu abe njia u mguanga din. Mungu mwe muri president, first son, ba minister abenja ulo, abavaka ba parliamenti, na abantu sechi nomu, abavu mutamani, na e, ngana uba sosu kodo kuvu ni ba wa statementi, kuvidi yezo, ngana uba mumiriza kumsonge. So kuno njiriza kuchia genda maso, na e nga bob ba kusimbiwa, mungu gaza mateka, ila kawe fuwe, wakuno njaba la la, aba kuzisa. Emi kuto migata ba anto wubi, gavalo wazomu kono guete kati guba tu keko na yeye acha agenda maso. We wouldn't want the incident that happened to the that happened in Matuga to happen again. Fortunately, it is that these cars are all small, but this can happen to a bigger car carrying fuel along the bridge. So we all ought to be very careful while we are driving these uh, vehicles. So <coughs> the other bit uh, is uh, to inform you that uh, today we shall be arraigning three individuals. That is uh, Taiwa Julius, 19 years of age, a resident of Mubende district. Uh, Sengozi David, also known as Lucky Choice, 21 years of age, businessman, resident of Nasana, Wakiso. Sekajiri Isaya, uh, 28 years of age, businessman, resident of Gimbo in Wakiso district. Uh, these are charged with uh, the offense of. Uh, are charged with the offense of uh, computer misuse and also sp uh, spreading hate speech. Uh, they have been seen in uh, very different videos on uh, specifically TikTok, uh, spewing hate, abuses of all sorts on different personalities. Of course, these personalities include uh, uh, the President of the Republic of Uganda, the first son, other media personalities, other politicians. So they are going to be arraigned today at uh, Entebbe Magistrate Court. And uh, I felt you should be aware. What do you want to do? 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 What Nigasa sana ni goche dukari yenu na mchara kabarunji aleni yari mchinaviro, ubada mchisenge che na ulia mita boxinge kuba gana, umuka then na uliro umuliro. Polisi ategezewa ena ni yangu amangu ni soro kwa nini tasa, ebi tu ebi dada ni inga bichi mu chari muduka cha yononeka. So, chino changeo gede kwa wali maso, soro kura ni sembere no, ndoto kuzesa bulunji. Ewe ntu vya febya masanyalaze, ngatukoze sabulu unji, 
abatu connecting ila masanyalazi nga beba tufu na abakulu okuva masanyalazi okukola yo team egenda ngekebera kubutia mayumba gano wagati kamu amasanyalazi weba uh, yesterday at about 7:58 we received a phone call our police at Entebbe received a phone call that uh, <clears throat> there was a burning vehicle on Entebbe Expressway near Nambigira. Na? Nambigira. Nambigira Bridge. Uh, the fire prevention and rescue services responded swiftly and successfully contained the blaze. Uh, the vehicle was a Subaru, the registration number UBB837C. Uh, we believe the occupants es escaped unharmed. Uh, we didn't find them at the scene by the time we are extinguishing the fire. I'm um, yet to find out whether they followed up their they followed up for their vehicle, uh, which is now parked at Entebbe Police Station. We don't know what caused this, but uh, what I can say is that this is the third incident on that road, uh, making it three incidents within a span of like one week. Uh, three vehicles have caught fire. Uh, some had already left the expressway already in Entebbe Stretch, heading to the airport, caught fire. The fire prevention and rescue services managed to respond to all the three incidents and put, uh, put, uh, put off the fire. However, the vehicles are damaged, and uh, of course, that of course remains to the owner. We have nothing to do for them but only advise them that next time, if you want to save your vehicle, our response time is usually 11 minutes, uh, 15. Uh, the good thing is that the road has no jam, but if you're in places where there is jam, of course our response time will differ. It can even take 30 minutes or an hour. So you need to do, uh, you need to also take the matters into your own hands. Have fire extinguishers with you as you move. These vehicles are supposed to be equipped with fire extinguishers. If you sense a smoke is coming from the tires, because maybe you are over speeding, or it is coming from the cab uh, uh, bonnet, please take action and extinguish the fire before authorities can come in to uh, assess the situation uh, before it goes out of hand. Uh, at approximately, yes. At approximately 1:46 uh, a.m. in the morning, uh, we received information of a fire that had broken out at uh, Kalere Market. Uh, the fire is believed to have started from uh, the east end of the market along Gayaza Road, spreading rapidly and destroying several wooden stalls. Uh, of course, after receiving this information, the Fire Prevention and Rescue Services uh, responded promptly and successfully contained the fire. It took us some time, of course, uh, as you all are aware, our officers just left that place uh, this very morning. Uh, of course, we managed to stop it from spreading further to the nearby building, uh, which houses a bank. Uh, while investigations are ongoing to determine the exact cause of the fire, preliminary findings suggest that the fire may have resulted from uh, electrical sparks. According to a few statements we've recorded, some witnesses allege that they had sparks on uh, one of uh, the electric poles and uh, it's from there that a fire started now in one of the sh shops. Uh, we believe this is because of uh, the illegal power connections and installations within the market kiosks. Uh, our recommendations is uh, that uh, we urge UMEME to conduct regular inspections of electrical connections, particularly in the wooden structures. We also recommend that all electrical installations in kiosks and shops are carried out by certified personnel who are professional to prevent similar incidents in the future. Uh, the fortunate bit is that no injury or life 
was uh, or, or loss of life was registered and uh, investigations are ongoing to determine what exactly happened.